Hey, good afternoon. Right now, you know, you're talking to Nate Styles, um, local barber of Tampa, Florida. Um, I own a barbershop called City Trends Barbershop. But right now, but right now, as you know, the month of March, uh, we got impacted by the coronavirus pretty heavily. Um, and Friday that just passed um, was March, I believe, 27th. They issued a stay at home order, uh, which impacted my barbershop pretty heavily. Um, uh, they specified that barbers um, should close because it is a highly, it's a high percentage that we are able to transfer the virus through, uh, through our, our work because we're not able to uh, pretty much follow the coordinates of uh, social distancing. So they gave us a temporarily closed order, which has no end date. So right now I'm pretty much trying to occupy myself because I don't want to worry too much. So today I'm gonna clean one of my several weapons. Um, I've, uh, Taken to Derek Grace and 19 Keys, two very solid individuals. I noticed that Derek Grace is a weapon connoisseur, and I noticed that he cleans his weapons quite often. You know, he shows his children how to um, understand and utilize a weapon. So, what I'm doing is I'm just getting familiar with some weapons that I've had um, for quite a while. I think it's time for me to clean them and understand how to open and break it down, put it together, and modify it as well. I mean, it's only right. Um, I feel like it's something I should teach myself because I noticed that um, educating and self-awareness is, is, is very critical right now. Um, so I just hope that everybody else, you know, that has the time, you know, is able to uh, sit down and find appreciation for what I'm doing and also self-teach and become self-aware also. So I'm gonna get right into it. Everybody have a good day. Um, pretty much what we're gonna be working on is IWI um, Uzi pistol. Uh, it's a 22 caliber, as you can see. Um, you wanna make sure that before you get started that there are no shells in there. Clearly, as you see, there was one. on safety. Yeah, you want to make sure it's empty before you get started. Put it on safety. And let me go right. Like I said, it's IWI Uzi pistol. I bought it uh, a few years ago. The only cleaner is I have a cleaner lubricant preservative that I also bought when I bought the gun. Uh, it's pretty good actually has a slight odor, but it's not anything that you're not able to tolerate. It's not bad. Um, comes with, you know, your cleaning items. Um, I have two Allen keys and a wrench. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get started. I understand the first thing you do is you uh, have and unscrew a piece by the barrel that you can screw off. Uh, I'm not too sure of the pieces. I'm gonna go through the pieces and list them, the identification of the pieces as we go on. But uh, yeah, you can unscrew that. You know, what you wanna do is you wanna put it on the side that it's a tin. You know, you can reach it. It also comes with a wrench. The wrench is two. Also, open the barrel so you're able to gather all the pieces. These are all pieces that are attached to the barrel. Now, that's that. This is a 22 caliber, so you can notice that the barrel is a little smaller than a nine millimeter. Um, in the back now, you have a button that you can push to eject top piece, which comes off pretty easily. Um, then you're gonna have your spring, which 
you want to do. Pull it all the way back. Try not to hurt yourself like I just did. Sorry about that. You're gonna have to remove the cover off of the center. Then you wanna pull it back. I want you to get weight, spring, spring um, next what you're gonna want to do is use your allen key you should be able to push these two buttons out so you can separate the top from the bottom of the gun it's your allen key just want to take it and push I have two Allen keys actually, smaller one. I'm gonna take it and push. <laughs> Watch these able to be removed. just want to clean and make sure that you lubricate the barrel of your gun And what we're gonna do from here, pretty much is everything that we did in the beginning, we're gonna reenact in reverse so that we're able to put the gun back together and use our weapon. <laughs> 